Here I'm going to read about Ecclesiastes 12. Remember your Creator in the days of your youth. People, the days of trouble come and the years approach when you will say, I find no pleasure in them. People, the sun and the light and the moon and the stars grow dark and the clouds return after the rain when the keepers of the house tremble and the strong men stoop when the grinders cease because they are few and those looking through the window grow dim when the door to the street are closed and the sounds of grinding fades when the man lies up at the sound of birds, but all their songs grow faint. When men are afraid of heights and of dangers in the street, when the almond tree blossoms and the grasshopper drag himself along the desire no longer is stirred, the man goes to his eternal home and mounders go around the streets. Remember him before the silver cord is served or the golden bowl is broken, before the pitcher is shattered at the spring or the wheel broken at the wall, and the dust returns to the ground it came from, and the spirit, spirit returned to God who gave it. Meaningless, meaningless, says the teacher. Everything is meaningless. So what we need to do? Next verse, Ecclesiastes 12, 9. Not only was the teacher was wise, but also he imparted knowledge to the people. He pondered and searched out and set in order many proverbs. The teacher searched to find just the right word, and what he wrote was upright and true. The words of the wise are like gold. They are collected saying like firmly embedded nails given by one shepherd. Be warned, my son, of anything in addition to them, of making many books there is no end. And much study wears the body. Now all has been heard. Here is the conclusion of the matter. Fear God and keep His commandments. For this is the whole duty of man. For God will bring every deed into judgment, including every hitting things, whether it is good or evil.